Welcome back. And today I'm going to be reviewing Elf. So I got this package actually yesterday and I forgot what was actually in it because I ordered it so long ago. So we're about to open it up and I know there's this one face mask that I really want to use. And since Mary's in town, why not do it with her? Yeah, I'm the best. Would you like to open the box? Yeah. Now for everybody's favorite ASMR. They really don't want you to get into it. I think that's a good thing. One hour later. Elf, OMG! Face primer that she just thought it was so pretty she had to have. So this is the product. It's a really cool ho hollow. Is that hollow? I'm sure y'all will correct me if I'm wrong. Box. And it helps protect against environmental aggressors like pollutants and dust and smokes. And it's formulated without parabens, sulfates, and alcohol. So it's good for you. And it's vegan and cruelty free. It also has like sunflower seed oil, vitamin C, vitamin E, argan oil to help replenish your skin. And it's this cool magnetic tool and it'll just lift that shit right off. Okay, so you'll want to use the magnetic tool to apply the mask to your clean, dried face. And you just leave it on for five to 10 minutes. And then you just wave the magic wand and it's gonna move it off. So I'm excited because I've never had one of these before and I just recently heard about it. So let's get started on this. Ta-da! And it came with this little thing, which I think is for um, grabbing the product so you don't make it all messy on the little, wand? I'm not sure what that's called. Okay, a wand. So it doesn't make it messy on the wand. That makes sense. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, that's pretty. It's very sleek and clean looking. It does look clean. I like it. Here it is. Nice. How's it smell? Oh no. <laughs> Not like smell. I mean, wait. Don't tell me. I want to smell it first and see what. One minute, 37 seconds later. It smells clean, almost like... It smells clean, but I don't know what that is. Kind of like Lysol. Yeah. Ooh. I kind of like the filling of it. Oh yeah, y'all like that? Alright, let's get started. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess we just put this over like a condom. <laughs> there we go. It's all nice and tight. Important to be safe. I'm going to use the actual tool and she's going to use the brush from Gleeman. Ooh. Mm hmm. It oh. feels so weird. This is so strange feeling. How does it feel to you? A little. It kind of feels soft. Yeah, it just, I don't know. It's just weird. I kind of like it, like, I don't know. I like the feeling of it. Me too, but the instructions don't say whether to put it on thick or thin. And you kind of put stuff on thin, and I feel like I put it on thick. So I'd like to see how strong that magnet is, if it's gonna pull, oh, if it's gonna pull all the product off if I have it on thick. Done. 
How do we always get done the same time? Okay, so how long did it say to wait? 10 minutes? Five to 10 minutes. Five to 10 minutes. I don't feel like it gives you that much product. Yeah, it, just it's just about done. Long. So it says recommended usage is one to two times a week. You'd have to buy a lot. Yeah. Well, I don't know. I only dipped once with this guy and I was able to spread it around pretty good without having to re-dip a lot. Me on the other hand, with this little thing, I feel like I had to keep getting more and more. So, so maybe use... Maybe use a brush, brush because it seems like it was better. This one, I can't really feel it on my face. I don't know. I like the way it feels. It feels like, really light. Like I don't feel yeah, like I have anything on. Yeah. I really like it. Me too. I'm Let's excited see to see how it turns off. Look at that. Oh my God, it's coming off in chunks. See? And it feels weird. What does it feel like? I don't know. Like it's trying to get all of my pores. It doesn't, it doesn't hurt, but. It never, uh, whoa. Look at that. And how's it gonna take all this off my face? My head is too big. Is it gonna have <laughs> enough room? It never got tight either, like on your face. Yeah, it's just like nice and velvet like. Yeah. I don't know. I like it. Um, like yeah, chunky action. it's still taking it off. So, do you need to like wipe off the tool every once in a while? I don't know. It didn't say. Oh my god, Whoa. this is so cool. Wait. It's getting pretty. Yeah, it's not getting as strong anymore. Yeah, it's getting hard. Look at that. I'm giving it points off because this is very time consuming as opposed to just take some water and rub it off. I think it says in the directions not to use water for best results. So this is what it wants. I know, but look how long it takes to just I know. magnetize it all off. Okay, you know what? I think if you actually put it on your face and kind of just slowly do like this, you can get it all off. So we're gonna try that on your face. It's like, it's like a little tacky on your face, but if you touch it, it like turns to powder. Mm. <laughs> Weird, right? Like you can't even- It like tugs my skin. Yeah, but it doesn't hurt. It's like a light tug, like, hey. It's like a love tap, right? doesn't have much detail so like and it's like more magnetic in the middle instead of the outside so I can't like just take it and come like this I have to get more in the middle for it to actually do anything which it does kind of just wipe off like like powder like I don't know how that does anything for your skin honestly yeah it didn't harden it didn't do anything it just kind of turns into powder. Your final thoughts. I don't feel like it does anything. It just turns to powder and it's like, doesn't feel like you have anything on you. Like what could it possibly be doing for your skin? So I guess for me, I like the fact that, um, that it came off the way that it did. Cause I thought that was really cool. But um, after a while, you actually have to like use a napkin to wipe it off because some of it gets really hard to take off because there's so much product on your face. And then also, I don't like how you have to use the back of this because you then have to use something else that they didn't provide you inside the box to sit there and wipe it off or you're gonna just grab the whole product like this so that your hands are gonna get super messy. Yeah. I do like that they gave you little condom slips. I think that's pretty cool that they did that. And then I also do not like that there wasn't a lot of product inside the actual jar. Yeah, you didn't get much. Yeah, at all. So what are your, what are your positives? The magnetic thing's kind of cool, but I feel like that's my only positive. Yeah. And then also um, 
once you get done taking it off your face, you still have to like grab a napkin or something like that yeah, and, and wipe it off. Yeah, it still like there's powder on Yeah, your like face. Um, there is powder still on it. Like you can still see the, the black. Yeah, so, I have like a black mustache going across here from it. Yeah, and then um, on top of that, it tells you for the best use of it not to use water. So it's kind of like, what now? I guess I will use it maybe again but maybe once a week because there's not a lot of product in it and yeah so i guess i'll see you guys next week that's it bye oh.